Welcome back guys to the next episode of Scarvide. Um, in the last episode, um, what did I do in the last episode? Oh yeah, I, I fought the Ace Gym Leader. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure that's it. And we finished up the uh, Titan quest line. So now we're going to make our way to the Pokemon League um, and get this show on the road. Uh, so yeah, if you guys are enjoying the playthrough as always, please leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more. Yeah, let's, uh, let's make it. We're gonna go, we're gonna walk in there, we're gonna knock everything out, and we're gonna walk out clean. Right? <laughs> I don't really think we'll struggle too much though, to be completely honest. I think we'll be uh, more than enough prepared. Um, tomorrow should be Pokemon Reborn, so if you guys are expecting when that's gonna be coming, so that's when that'll happen. Uh, so yeah, let's, uh, let's get going. You just put uh, this kid. There was this, there was a hiker I fought out here that like messed me up. He had like level 54 Pokemon. This kid level 14. I don't even think there's any. I mean, I guess you can. The only merit to battling like every trainer is like the TM. So I, I guess that's a pretty good reason to do it. There's the front door. That's the guy that like, messed me up. You know what? I'm gonna beat him too. I don't appreciate how he beat me that one time. Summon out like a level 54 Pokemon. Call me salty, but yeah, maybe I just can't. Look at that. I can see into the ground. Level 56, my question. This is the Mega Man Zero version. <laughs> oh no! Absolutely done. What does that do? Oh, you gained it. Okay. I should be able to. Absolutely. Wrong Earlier today, I was actually doing a battle, and my opponent sent out uh, a portal that had drought, but it was raining in the overworld, so it was sunny and raining at the same time. Kind of weird how that can happen, uh, but it can. Pokemon Center. Mm 
There we go. Hello. So this is it. You've decided to face the Pokemon League. The final test you must pass to become champion is held here in this building. I wish you the best of luck from the bottom of my heart, Belle. I look forward to meeting you again soon. We made it. We're here. We're inside the league, and it's time. Oh, what the? Thank you for coming today. Please do have a seat. I, Rika, will be your interviewer. Let's get started with the first portion of the champion assessment. We begin with the interview. First things first, let me see how many gym badges you have. Excellent, you have all eight. Next, I'd like to ask you a few questions if you wouldn't mind. Please think carefully as you may automatically fail the interview depending on your answers. Let's begin. How did you get here today? I walked, I rode on my Pokemon, I came by flying taxi. I rode on my Pokemon. Very, very good. Please tell me the name of the school you are enrolled in. Ah, that's right. So what brings you to, po to the Pokemon League today? I came to catch Pokemon. I came to become a champion. Just for fun, I guess. Let me give them the politically correct answer. Why else would you be here, I suppose? Now, what do you intend to do if, you, uh, if and when you become a champion? I want to battle Nimona. I want to find treasure. I want to become even stronger. I see. Interesting. Tell me. Which of the eight gyms gave you the most difficulty? I guess it's the normal one by default. I see. And what was the name of the gym leader you faced there? It was Larry. I'm glad. I'm glad you seem to remember. But do you remember which type of Pokemon Larry used? Normal. Wonderful. Building the skills needed for the champion assessment is no small feat. You must have met a lot of Pokemon to get here, Belle. What was the category of Pokemon you chose to be your first partner? The Grass Cat. Though I have all three. Very, very good. Now please forgive me, but I'm going to repeat a previous question. Remind me, what do you intend to do if, you, if and when you become a champion? I want to become stronger. Ah, uh, yes, that's right. Next is the final question for this interview. Just, let's just throw off the table and let's throw our Pokemon out in this fight. Do you like Pokemon, Bell? Yeah, of course. Why would I bring this? Why, why would I make it this point if you had to ask me that question? You want to fight? Let's just fight. Get the interview over with. Good job, kiddo. That about wraps up the interview. Let me be the first to congratulate you, Belle. You just passed the first part of the champion assessment. I, uh, a fifth grader could pass that, come on. On your first try too, no less. Don't think anyone's done that since Nimona. How? Those questions are easy. But anyway, time to switch gears and get ready for the next segment. The second segment is what we call the Elite Test. I find it funny that they're trying to be more formal with this. You'll be facing the Elite Four in Pokemon battles. That is what I expected to happen. I guess that's pretty obvious from the name of the test, huh? Anyway, we're the best the League has to offer. You'll be facing us four in a row, no turning back. This won't be a cakewalk, I promise you that. Make sure you're all ready, then go into the room behind me. I am, am ready. All right, Mayal Skiata, you're gonna take point. Everyone else, you're gonna survive the course. 
We're killing everything. Let's go. Let's go. This room. Nothing about the type. I already knew this person was a part of the Elite Four, so I'm not particularly surprised that they were going to be my first. Now nah, then, let's get this started. Let good old Rika be the first of the Elite Four to take you on. I'd say I'll go easy on you, but I'd be lying. Think fast. Let's go. Wish cash. Ground or water? The room's blue. I finally get to battle you. I've been looking forward to this. So don't you give up too soon. Oh. Now we both know that's not an option. That's not always time. Terrestrialize out the gate. This is going to kill it anyway, but... I figure if this is a type thing like it always has been, Grass is going to be super effective on either of the two types I'm I've been presented with. Next. Camera. It's ground. Okay. I like how the arena is like lit up properly. Uh, when I switched out my terrestrial as Pokemon. Nice attention to detail. The poor poor Quad Volvo, this Pokemon would have been great if it were just faster, right? Like, it, it literally just suffers. It has a great typing. It just suffers from having, like, really bad, like, speed. Like, Moxie is an insane ability, hidden ability, too. Aqua Step is not that great of a move, unfortunately. Like, base 80 just is, it's not strong enough to kill anything. And a Pokemon like this kind of just needs to kill whatever it's looking at. So you have to use Wave Crash. Which, while a great move is much more risky. Oh, that's fine. We're eating that up. Ground. This room definitely didn't tell me I was facing a ground type drain. Dug Trio. I like how Pokemon, like, in the midst of switching. Pokemon to let out battle cries. Claude's are. Nah. <laughs> Impressive. You really are something else, kiddo. Uh huh. Let's finish this. Go on, Clockfire. Shake things up a bit. Hmm. a lot of ground. Okay. Chose to go for protect.
Not bad, kiddo. You almost look disappointed that I swept you. My shoes are clipping to the floor. Talk about unfair. No way was I ever going to win that one. Still though, what a great battle. Felt good even to lose. Not a whole lot of trainers have skill to make it past the elite test, but who knows? I'm beginning to think you might be the one few that do. Better stay on your toes though. The second of the elite four is stronger than me. You're up next, Squirt. Come on out. Oh. There's no ascending rooms. They just come in and... Oh. Yeah, I did. She's no pushover, let me tell you. I'll be watching from the side. Avenge me if you can, eh? You bet I will. Oh. Oh, I do get a break. I was going to say, I thought I was going to do a full-on gauntlet. I would have been like, whoa, that's way harder than anything they've ever... I mean, it, it won't be, but... Still pretty cool. What's this pint-sized person use? I don't really know. Yes. She uses here's a key. Maybe steal? It's so cool you made it this far, but this is where you say bye-bye, miss. All my Pokemon are super tough. Your weak attacks won't work on them at all. They'll bounce right off. You'll see. I can't wait for you to meet my friends, so here they come. I'm guessing she's Steel, right? Like, Steel makes the most sense. I guess we'll see. Yeah, hell yeah. Okay. Go on, Raja. Smush him. trying to set up on me. That's fine. Absolutely not. Bronze on. I'm actually going to go for Shadow Ball because this Pokemon gets Fuck it, we're going for a uh, fire blast. He gets uh, that move that like reduces fire damage. I mean that ability. But uh, fuck it. I didn't feel like burning him first. Tinker Ton. If only my Tinker Ton had uh, electric, I'd send it in for the meme. Why switch out? have a Tinkaton battle. Unfortunately mine doesn't really have any moves for the mirror. 
I'm not scared. My last Pokemon will turn things around. If she terrestrializes steel, I kind of just get bodied. It's time to get dressed up all pretty, Tinky. No wonder she's fucking, like, a strong trainer. She specializes in the, one of the most broken types. Well, Mr. the fairy. Freaking steel. Is that an axe? That's nuts. This Pokemon Skeleton is super defensive. Alright. The next one's the art guy. The, the, was it the librarian or the prof whatever he was? The professor. Pretty sure you mean take revenge for me, not on. <laughs> Holy crap. Don't think I did anything wrong by you. Hate to say it, but you lost, Poppy. Better call the next guy. Oh, that's right. I haven't had to do this in a long time. It's your turn, Mr. Larry. What? He got promoted. Hello there, it's me, Larry. Considering he fucked me up the last time we did this, I'm actually down for her. Well, I mean, I won, but you know, he was the gym leader that gave me like the biggest pause. So you made it this far. I serve as a member of the Elite Four too. Yes, unfortunately for me. At my gym, I use normal type Pokemon since I feel they have a lot in common with me. But well, the boss told me to use a different type here. So if you have any complaints, please take them up with La Primera. Interesting. Dark, maybe? Anyway, time to get to work. Flying. Well, I'll be trying my hand with flying type Pokemon this time. Interesting decision. Why is Tropius so damn small, by the way? Look at that thing. Faster, chlorophyll. God, but it's also a fucking trophy. Ooh, that did a lot of damage, though. I don't lie. But it is. A Star after. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. He would use the opposite, uh, the other type of his ace. Unfortunately, I'm, a, I'm not really here to lose. Although that's kind of annoying. Oh, he lived because that intimidate, but he flinched. That's what you get for intimidating me.
So imagine what that would look like in the anime. My freaking Baxcalibur just inhaled that freaking Altaria into the wall there. Poor Corio. If it's the fire type Oracorio. Is it? The electric type. Okay, yeah, switching out wasn't working then. Flamingo. I'll let Tinkerton do it. Should be able to take him out. You're even stronger than before. Guess I don't get a break today. No, you, you, you don't. I'll meet his energy, even though... He's, he's gonna try for a spine. At the risk of messing up my suit a bit, it's time to get some wind out of our backs. I'm surprised you didn't terrestrialize the Star Raptor again. I'm curious if the Star Raptor was supposed to come out there. And this is his like designated terrestrialization Pokemon. I don't really know. That's pretty good for the drop. Oh, now I resist this. Oh yeah, this was the play. Because now I get to do this. Put it against the wall. Bop! Terrestrialization is such a good mechanic. It does a lot of what it should do. And I, I appreciate it. It doesn't get rid of stabs, which I like. That was the fear. You're a lot of sh you're a lot stronger than I recall. No wonder Lapi Meta likes you. Now then, I suppose the final member of the Elite Four is next. Your turn, Hassel. Now where could he be? Don't think he heard you, Larry. Come on in, Hassel. Larry, you might you may need to speak up just a little bit more. Hassle! Hassle, you're up next! Is he like deaf or something? Was he just waiting outside the door? Hello there, Belle. It delights me to see you here. As for you, Larry, I see you made Rika do the shouting again, hmm? So I don't know this guy's Pokemon type. I gotta imagine it's something less. It's definitely gonna be something we haven't seen before. I was, of course, absolutely certain you would make it to me eventually. Young sprouts truly do grow with outstanding speed, yes. But I never for a moment imagined we would be facing each other so soon. Now a teacher's duty is to guide students and aid their growth. But I think I shall forget about my role as a teacher for a moment. And wield all my might for the sole purpose of defeating you. I am Hassel, the dragon guarding the final fortress of the elite test. Prepare to learn the first hand how fiery breath of ferocious battle feels. Okay. Dragon. Let's go then. 
Nice gloves, by the way. I'm, I'm digging the gloves they got. Show me everything you've got. I shall face you with my full strength. This Elite Four is made out of really good typing. Like ground, steel, um, flying, and then dragon. Yeah, that's pretty good. Play rough. That's not what I want. Okay, there goes half my health. That's fine. Would have been a two-hit KO, but fine. Okay. The little guy gets his chance. Or her chance. I forgot. I'm not even gonna hold back. Let's just do this. That's actually a little annoying. I'm getting some decent damage. That's actually super annoying. That's not even a little annoying. That's super annoying for God. I don't want to stay in now because of that. It's okay. Were all their Pokemon level 60? I don't I'm, I wasn't paying attention. But all of his are. Come on then. His last Pokemon should be his own back to Malibu I bet. Yep. Come on, little one. Only a little more until you pass. Don't let up. Oh no, I'm clicking play rough and killing you no matter what happens here, so. Come, oh great dragon, and take a Terra Jewel as your crown. God fucking damn it. Players is missed twice in this one fight. Whatever. Guess my arm's gotta do it. That's fine. The mighty dragon has been felled. Yes, it has. You really did it. Oh, wow. Huh. Oh, wonderful. I've, 
I'm just so proud of you. Hoi, 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 hoi. Don't cry, Grandpa Hassel. There, there. Want a hug? Sorry about all this, Bell. The old man can get like this sometimes. So, what do what do I do? I just I just so overwhelmed. Guess I've just got to do the talking. Anyway, your result of the elite test of the champion assessment is pass. A pass, no doubt about it. Obviously. Yeah, you're rougher than steel. Yep. You did so beautifully. Congratulations. I'd say you're good to go, but there's actually just a wee bit more to the champion testament. Oh, I know. This will be your final trial. See the door back there? Our field is commander. The final opponent you'll face for your test is waiting beyond it. Her skills are so amazing. She was able to strong arm all of us into joining the Elite Four. You won't find a mightier champion. Though I think you'll be fine, kiddo. You beat me after all. I'll patch up your team on the house, so don't you lose, you hear? Oh, absolutely not losing. I really love your Pokemon, miss. So I'll cheer for you as hard as I can. Well, uh, good luck. Every, even a baby dragon can be fire. What the fuck? Whoa. Guess you got, your so got over your sobs, huh? You can do this. We all know you can. Now go, young Bell. Your hands may be small, but let them seize a great victory. No, I want Greta to be behind that board, but I enjoy Nimona first. Nimona first would be interesting. We can do Greta later. If like Greta's the uh, super boss, I, I want to battle the both of them, but I do want this to be Nimona right here. And this is a great arena. Welcome, Bell. It gives me great joy that you've managed to make it all the way to the pinnacle of the Pokemon League. The final test is a battle against me, the top champion. To pass, all you need to do is win. But before we get started, I should apologize for one thing. You see, I have a trait that some might say is inappropriate of the League Chairwoman. I am utterly incapable of holding back when it comes to Pokemon battles. Maybe that's why nobody's passed this test recently. It's a bit of a problem, to be honest. But you, you might manage something wonderful like Champion Nimona did. So are you ready for your final test? I want to see the true measure of your talent. Okay. Top Champion Guitar. Let's put out a... I do hope you can defeat me and become a champion yourself. Dude, I need to battle. What's her name? If she's not up here, then I need to know how strong she really is. Yes, that was the correct decision in this situation. Please continue. Oh. She was shining on me. What's the matter? You're not one to let something so insignificant fluster you. Oh, I couldn't give a shit about that. Okay, yeah, we, we got the right Pokemon out here. I think something can't hold back. Me neither. Let's do it. Hit him with the big one. Ooh, ah. Trying to hold back too. Oh well. Oof. It's okay, little one. You did your best. Flower trick should kill. Oh, 
I was gonna say this is a six on six and we're trading Pokemon, but then I realized this is a five on six. Truly a devastating blow. That deserves a standing ovation. Go, go. whatever this Pokemon puts out no matter what, right? Uh... Oh, a critical hit. Poor thing. Yeah, that was a critically resisted hit. Didn't even do 5%. I actually really like Skeletor. It and Meowskarada are really good Pokemon. They, I've come around to both of them. I'm still on the fence about Quad Evolve, although. King Gander. Like, it's just so slow, but once I get a Moxie uh, Quad Evolve, ball, ball, like, sword. Well, I guess Sword Stand. Probably not necessary. It's just setting up with this Pokemon. This Pokemon would have been insane if it had Dragon Dance, right? Because it's like, with Moxie, you don't really want to waste too much time on, like, Sword Dance. You want Dragon Dance because you want to boost your speed. So you, But then you have to use Aqua Step to do that. But Aqua Step doesn't, like... Aqua Step isn't Dragon Dance, you know what I mean? Like, you have to find specific opportunities for that to be good. So... I'm not saying like agility would have been crazy, but like with Dragon Dance, it sets up like your Moxie Sweep while allowing you to like boost your speed. The loser. I don't know what this Pokemon is. So there's some in my uh, Miascarada. Looks like a water type, or is it a poison water type because it's purple? I don't know. It's a water type. Okay. Flower shirt. That's the bouquet. This champion has Cynthia energy, but she's not Cynthia. Cynthia's the queen. Gilmora. Gleemora. I don't know what this does. Or what this is. So. It's an M Max Caliber. Don't think you've won just yet. Do I think I've won? Not particularly. I've never seen this Pokemon before. Oh well, Trash the Ice Dragon, we'll see what the fuck happens. He's going all in. Her Pokemon don't seem particularly impressive though, I'll be honest. I haven't seen anything that was like, holy crap, this is crazy. There's no Garchomp. There's no, you know, Milotic. There's no Spirit Tomb. What's, what's the ace here? This time. Wow, like no. What, is this? what type is it? Rock? I don't know. It lived, though. Huh. Not. Oof. Toxic debris. This is the Pokemon you send out at the start of the fucking battle. That's an insane ability. 
You get hit and just get toxic spikes up for free? Alright, where Namona at? You go beyond my imagination so easily. Such overwhelming power, such amazing skill. It seems Paldea has gained another wonderful trainer to be proud of. Congratulations. It is my honor to call you champion, Belle. Congratulations is right. Now I can really say you're good to go. Yay, you did it, miss. I'm not done. Where's Nimona at? Congratulations. It's just a amazing. I, I can't hold it in anymore. He's crying again, man. You Pokemon trainers are the treasure of Paldea. And amid that treasure, champions are the jewels that shine brightest. Champion Bell, it is now your duty to set an example for all of the trainers of Paldea. Now allow me to walk you to the back of the entrance. I'm certain you'll find a familiar face awaiting you. Yes. Yes, the true champion battle. Bell, Bell, it's Goku. Oh man. I can tell just looking at you, you did it, right? You became a champion. Yeah. I knew it all along. I got word from La Primera when you cleared the, uh, the elite test. Oh man, Bell, I'm a champion. Now you're a champion. Which means we're true equals. You and me, both champion rank trainers. This is amazing. Now that you've made it here, I got one thing to say. You and me, yo, let you and me be rivals for life. Bet. Yes, Tomoya. All right, you must know what rivals do. Battle their absolute heart out. I'm going to hit you with everything this time. You ready? Do wait a moment. No, no, this is what I wanted. This is what I wanted. What's the matter, Premier? The champion session has only just ended, and I believe a rest is in order for champion, though. Miyaskarada and the others. Champions must be understanding towards their opponents. Right. There. I, there I go getting excited again. Sorry, Bell and Meow Scarada. I also must ask. Uh, I also must ask. Is this? Bleh. I also must ask. Is this roadside really the setting you two want for your first battle as true equals and rivals? Now that you mention it, that's a good point. In that case, can we use one of the Pokemon League battle courts? Surely, there's somewhere more fitting. A place for a special meaning for the two of you, perhaps. Special meaning, huh? Let me see. Anywhere leap to mind? Out behind your house, Magoza, the treasure eatery. Mesagoza. Mesagoza. Good call. The place where we set out on our journey. That reminds me, Bell. Remember back when Dr. Clavel explained the treasure hunt? You know, he told us to go in search of our own treasure. Well, I know what treasure I got out of all this. I found a true rival. Someone who can stand up to all my full capabilities. That's right. I mean you. I'm so glad I got to meet you, Belle. Anyway, that being said, I'll be waiting for you at the battle court in Mesagoza Central Plaza. See you there. I res uh, the respect you two share is palpable, even a bit uh, enviable, to be honest. I am known as La Punera, but even when facing me in the final test of her champion assessment, Champion Nimona didn't reveal her full might. In you, I suspect she has found someone she can battle without holding anything back. Ooh. So what you're saying is she's the ultimate. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. Let's go. I feel like they should add a feature that allows you to change your, um, the Pokeballs that your Pokemon are in. That'd be nice, right?
The fact that I can ride on this mountain is kind of impressive. Oh. Never mind, I thought I could just fly in. So it's not 100% seamless, but it's mostly seamless. Whatever. Where's the square? Should be around here. Right? Oops. There we go. Any second now. Oh, this should have been voice acted. There you are, Bell. You ready for a battle between champions? Because all these folks here seem ready to watch uh, work got around, I guess. And out of every single person gathered here, the, I, uh, I'm the most excited by a mile. The stage is set. It's my all out power versus your strength in full fruition. Let's see who comes out on top. Okay. Real challenge by champion. Let's do it. Like it. Finally, the thing I've waited all this time for. Time to begin our greatest battle of all. What's your level? High 60s. Let's go. This is an even fight. That's what I like to see. I was worried they would have her at like low 60s, but no. To think I helped you teach you the type matchup, and now you're using them to put me down. Yeah, I am using them to put me down. Or put you down. A critical hit and a, at a critical moment. Fuck. Not saying so much. I'm trying to read it. Palmer. Palmer is the electric fight type, right? I was hoping to see like the Pokemon she became champion with. Not the Pokemon she used on this particular journey, but I guess not. Like it could have been a combination of them though. Orthworm. I don't know what this is, so Skeledurge. I mean Earthworm, I guess it's just an Earthworm, right? That's that's the play, right? It's probably like a ground bug. Kind of an obvious one. Right? Which version of Guja is this? That's the question. This, this doesn't look good at all. I was... The Dunsparce? No way you're a champion. You have that shit on your team. Whatever. I don't hate all Pokemon. I don't hate... You no, know, there are some Pokemon I'm not a fan of. And this is one of them. The only thing this Pokemon did wrong was be an evolution of a Pokemon that desperately needed one and just to come out looking how it did. This thing should have been like a crazy dragon type. This Dunspar should have just like the most beautiful Pokemon ever. That's what it should have been. Instead, it's just disappointing. Alright, 
who's wrapping this up? Yeah. That's how we started, right? How it started versus how it's gone. It's all down to this. My last Pokemon. We're gonna fight with everything we've got. It's a bit disappointing. I was I was excited for an even fight and then um, Hey. Terrestrialization could change things. Since blazing bright, my greatest treasure. Oh, shine blazing, br shine blazingly bright, my greatest treasure. I don't have this right here, but I think I might. Actually, I might just be reading too quickly. Hold on, I might have undiagnosed this right here. That could be a thing. Give her the bouquet. got swept she did you did it this is legit incredible you're the strongest out there Bill. oh my god I, I actually love this character i mean you knocked me flat and i was giving you absolutely everything i had everything i oh man pokemon battling am i right it's so much better so much more fun than i've ever Oh my god, this character is actually interesting. We have a character that's like... I don't think we've ever had a Pokemon arrival this enthusiastic about just improving. When they're already like good, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like they found a way to to break the whole... The only way a rival can be good or interesting if they're assholes to you, you know what I mean? And I still love that type of rival, but I like this one too. Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions. Oh, she wants to fight again. I hope she is like more Pokemon and more variety. I, I really want to see the Pokemon she became champion with the first time. I feel like until I get to see, if I do get to see that, I don't really get what I'm looking for. Victory road complete. Yep. Yo, Arvin here. Bow. Well, down boy, don't jump up like that. Seems like hearing your voice has old Mabla stuff here all worked up, Bell. Oh, but that's not why I called. Nearly forgot. You remember what we talked about before? You know, you know uh, about going to Area Zero? Yeah, of course. Of course you do, you, you little know-it-all. Got a mind like a steel's trap, eh? Well, all the effort you've been putting around in Paldea has really helped you make a name for yourself. Built up some goodwill, that's for sure. So I'm going to be able to secure two allies who want to go to Area Zero with us. That should have us uh, That should have us ready to tackle anything. So now all we got to do is get there. First step, we'll be gathering at Area Zero. I'll be ready and waiting for you at the Gate Zero gate. I'll see the location on your phone too. Don't leave me hanging forever. That's the Zero gate? Okay. Uh, we'll be waiting. Oh my map. It is right here. Okay. That's really cool. I, I guess I always forgot you slight like that. Huh. Anyways though, that's gonna be it for this episode guys. If you're enjoying this playthrough, please leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you later when the journey continues. Until then, take care and bye.